people that are close to me, like my family members and my roommates, they never expect me to be home, whether I'm at practice or at school. But um, for most people that don't really recognize cheerleading as a sport, they just look at the cheerleaders as people that are on the side of the um, field just with pom-poms and they don't look at how much work we actually put into practices and time before the game. We practice uh, two nights a week from 7 to 9.30 and then we have an extra night on Mondays that we come out, do conditioning for about an hour and a half, throw a little bit of partner stunning in there, tumbling in there. The kids are also expected to work out three to four days a week. have the flyer which is the person on top and then you have bases and usually there's three bases underneath who are holding the flyer and the flyer can go up like on both feet or they can go up on like one foot and um, the most difficult set would be the one to me is where the flyer is holding a heel stretch where they're holding their foot above their head which I can't do because I'm in base but then we um, we bounce her and we bring her down and she flips forward and we have to catch her and that's just terrifying for base and probably equally terrifying probably more terrifying for the flyer. Um, there's always going to be those, you know, people who have a, you know, their preconceived notions about it. And you know, that, you know, you develop a tough skin to it. It doesn't, it doesn't bother me anymore. And on top of it, you know, the people you meet, the experiences that you have, it, you know, you, you quickly put those people behind you. You know, I, I like to say I, I have one of the best seats in the, in the house. You know, when, when they're, when they're in the nosebleeds and I'm on the sideline. <laughs> I'm not going to lie, there's really no feel, uh, feeling like standing um, in the middle of the field running the flag for the first time as uh, the game is starting. That's pretty exhilarating it's, uh, in front of 55,000 fans, 65,000. So um, that's very exciting. But what keeps me coming back is, um, yeah, just the uh, potential to get better.